Hey everybody, I want to introduce y'all to the Red Lady. This woman is a symbol that I created some time ago for uh, things and stuff that I have felt personally and I have experienced personally. And I was going to do her as a painting project, but you know I'm famous for saying I have plans and God laughs and kind of like takes a shepherd's hook and he pulls me in a different direction. Well, I am going to be launching the Red Lady Gallery as a nonprofit. And before I take it to a brick and mortar building, I'm going to be doing this online as a, a show, like once a week to do an art show, pardon me while I scratch my foot, to do an art show of a woman's work. And, and here you need to know the definition. If you followed me for this long, I appreciate you so much. The Red Lady Gallery supports artists who have had to overcome economic, social, domestic, and physical violence in some form or fashion in their lives in order to become and reclaim their authentic selves. I don't, need, I'm, I don't intend on sharing the stories unless they want to, but right now what I'd like to do is go ahead and I've already interviewed one artist today and her work is really cool and um, I'm starting to line people up to put into these weekly art shows where you can buy something decent to support a woman who is rebuilding, reclaiming her life after going through one of these um, unfortunate and tragic situations that we hear of so many millions of women doing in the world today, especially in our country. And that's why you haven't heard from me. I've been uh, taking some time off to do a lot of thinking, a lot of planning, a lot of uh, interviewing of people, uh, making some decisions, and I just kind of really feel like running this nonprofit, uh, the Red Lady Gallery, that will support other female artists as they're trying to make a transition from maybe they had to leave an abusive husband um, or, or maybe... Uh, some other tragedy, a car wreck or something has happened to them and they need to sell their art, but they don't have the ability to do basically what I've been doing with all of y'all for all of these years. And so I'm going to help all of these women do that. Now, here's where y'all come in. Y'all play a big part in this. I brag to people all the time, I have the best followers on Facebook, and I really do believe that. So what I'd like for y'all to do is keep watch I can't announce the date yet, but very soon I'm going to do a live art show of everything in my own inventory, and I'm going to reduce it. I usually sell my art based on a buck fifty to two fifty a square inch, but for this show it's going to be seventy-five cents to a dollar a square inch because I want to raise this money to open up this foundation to start working with and nurturing other artists who have had to overcome these. Uh, obstacles, these tra tragedies, all the stories. There's so many stories, as, as you can imagine. And they're starting to trickle in to me. And I, I just want to be able to be in a position where I can help them generate income for themselves and nurture their careers. There's nobody really nurturing. Artists are solitary people by nature. We stay alone a lot. And there's nobody really nurturing uh, how do you how do you navigate your life as an artist? So um, that's my goal. That's what I'm getting ready to do. I, I'm talking way too much, and I apologize. If you've stayed with me this long, hey, I appreciate it. But this is what I want you to do. Pay attention to what's coming up with the Red Lady. She's a woman of victory. She's a woman who knows joy. She's a woman that has hope. She is a woman that all of us know. And we want to celebrate her by producing Red Lady Gallery live stream shows starting very soon on this page. If you know of an artist I should know about, please send me a message and let me know. Until then, thanks for hanging in there with me, and y'all are here for me again real soon. I love you all so very much.